so let's build a let's build a city on a mountain. Well, I should say we should build let's build multiple cities on a mountain. This is Lasara Summit Kingdom, which is out. Uh, a city builder on a mountain, multi city builder by uh, by quite okay games. Build expand your very own settlements in high mountains. Production chains that whole setting. So each each level of each mountain is going to be a little bit different because they're going to have different resources and different um uh, um what's the word. Uh, uh, biomes and basically resources. And so each one will be a little different. We got to deal with avalanches, of course. Let's try it out. See what we can do here. We've got standard mode campaign, I guess it's coming soon ish. There's a challenge mode you can fiddle with or just make the thing without any money or whatever. We'll go to standard mode, standard mode and go to Hope Spark Hill. Um, let's see, we got, uh, we got a copper deposit. We can import some other things. This is our. Very first outpost in the high mountains. This is this is tutorial land. Of all the years in the long and storied history of the kingdom of Lesara, this one surely has to be the worst. Following the harvest, a mysterious mist suddenly appeared all across the kingdom. Then the pandemonium started. Crops started to fail. Disoriented animals barely produced any milk. People started to get sick. And you can't see anything. The fog in this valley is even worse than the city. For all we know, we could be lost already. Faith, my friend, have faith. We're following the path that's been chosen for us. Path? I don't see any path. Just the same damn forest going on for days. It's not entirely the same. Look, there are more and more pines, and the thickets are thinning out. We are getting higher. We'll get to the upland shortly. Even if that's true, what will we find there? Mark my words, mountains are no place for humans. Yes, but they are a place of the spirits. We will settle at the foot of the mountain and make our way up to build a grand altar at the very summit. The spirits surely will recognize our efforts and help us to drive the mist away. And Lysara will be saved. Yeah, that's great and all, but did you see how low on supplies we are? Never mind building a temple. We'll die of hunger before even reaching the top. Come on. It won't be that bad. Look on the bright side. Mountains are above the mist, so we'll be able to cultivate crops and pasture our yaks again. Hmm, maybe. Until the first avalanche sweeps us all away. Stop worrying about minor details. We're on the most sacred quest, and nothing will stop us. Onwards. All right. Let's try out Lesara Summit Kingdom. Finally, a place above the mist with enough space to establish a small colony. Serve as an outpost when we move on to bigger mountains. Guess it makes sense. We need to maintain contact with the capital in case they need to come and save us. Nonsense. So each of these, all the yammering on here, each of these platforms are going to be different cities. We've got a city over here. We'll have one over here. We'll build a bridge to get over here. And then we'll build another one of these, like, lifts to get up on this side over here. Um, and there's probably some other stuff on the other side. This is, like, tutorial land, so it might be a little smaller. But we can... Scroll around here. Check this out. It looks real good. Look, there's a spot there. Each of these spots are going to have different resources. Ooh, spinny spin. Uh, we can middle click and look at the mountain. I played the demo of this. Man, it's been a couple years ago, a year ago or so, and it has substantially improved the uh, the graphics and the animation, uh, the smoothness of that as well. Uh, game speeds, one, two, three, space. All right, let's build a food market. So everything kind of in that like Pharaoh style. Everything's gonna need to be on the road and they're all gonna have like a range or anno, you know, that sort of a thing. Um, so we can go get ourselves, uh, yeah, yeah, okay, we'll follow this. Build a road to the food market. So there's our way up. We're gonna build a road like that and like that. Whoops. Oh, because there's a bump there, like that. All right, so now we get a road going to the food market. Now it wants, well, people. 
have 32 lowlanders living within the range of the market. So this is the lowlands. Once we get up here, we'll get a different cast uh, up here. Um, I don't know if it, I don't know how how if the maps are generated. Ooh, look at that fog rolling in there. I'm not sure if they're generated or if they're random, like if they're random in any way or, or if they're set. It does. It is definitely a different mountain than the de the demo I played a while back. That's definitely different. Uh, one thing I think is pretty neat about this that I remember from before is so we build one house looks like that. Uh, what are those kids hanging from the? What's going on there? Uh, we can make it if we put another house next to it. It grows into like a a bigger house and it keeps on going, and it, and it keeps on going. And the, and several buildings do that in this. Uh, we need more, so we'll do some over on this side, I guess. There we go. There is our houses. Very first settlers on the mountain. It's great. We should take care of the basic needs like shrines or food. Okay, let's go build ourselves a praying place, which is going to be a praying place. And you can see here in the Caesar style, whatever, we've got this sort of range that everything can, can make. And I'll put it right, I think, there. Like that. I didn't mean to bump that out like that, but it worked out well. Click on a hut. You can see the already fulfilled needs and the demanding demanded ones. The needs are in three categories. Food, prosperity, enlightenment. They have their praying place. They don't have their uh, food, you know. It's about a chicken farm. This game has a real fascination with, with yaks as well. Let's throw this one in. I think I'll put it in over here. Food land can be on this side. Like that. It's going to need a road. So we're right here. We get different, different styles of roads. Also, you can see there we got dirt roads, we got paved roads, and we have uh, tamped roads. We're doing just the dirt roads right now. Yeah, they'll start, but they'll be very spiritual. Uh, provide the lowlanders with eggs. So we need to click on this guy and point it to the food market. Um, hold left mouse button over the chicken farm. And point to the food market. So they, then they will now deliver the food over here, and then it'll get distributed to the people. Okay, increase food variety for our folks by building the, uh, with samp. Is that pronounced sampa? A flour made from barley. Use a mill, turn barley with the barley field and sampa. So look, this is a bigger step for us. Uh, I'm gonna do a road like. Oh, that doesn't actually. Oh yeah, it does. Like. Kind of hugging the mountain here so we can get back this way and we'll put our farms like around here. We got to keep things kind of, you know, in a bit of a range because of the way that the roads work. But we should be able to get away with doing something like this. We need a barley field. Let's take this guy. Um, a little fit there. A little something like that. And then that, and you can see how it how it connects those up. And we only, if we do that, we only need the one one road connector it basically can, it considers it one field once you do that they need to go into a mill which i'm going to stash is that in range of anything does that need to be in range of that you think let's put it like right there okay and then we just click on that okay oh maybe well maybe it doesn't connect uh, maybe it doesn't consider it as one field. i guess in certain things it's one field but not always and then you need to go there Okay, these guys all have their stuff. They can level up. Ooh, look at the changes. There we go. And now they're going to want more things. Level up, want more things. Okay, splendid. Lowlanders are happy here. They will be a backbone of the settlement's economy. Artisans won't be satisfied so easily. They're used to be uh, to a certain standard, you know. We want to progress... We need them for our, their manufacturing skills. They will live on this one. Okay, let's get a bridge. My favorite. And bridge over like that. Yeah, look at that. Forty artisans living over here within the range of a food market. Can they be? Uh, they need to be in their own home over here. So I'm assuming we don't want to put them over here. Yeah, they need to be over here. So let's set up. 
How much do each of these hold? These each hold four. Let's get the food market first, I suppose. Centrally located. Road. And then we'll come up here to this guy. Like that. Um, oh, yeah. Road needs to go over here also. Here we go. And then we'll put in more houses. The difference. Cool. Um, was that... Okay, anymore. There we go. Okay, fill progress bar halfway to 10. Is that uh, that progress, progress bar? Provide them with food and access to enlightened enlightenment facilities, just like you did with the lowlanders. Enlightenment would be the uh, the shrine, yeah. Goes in there. Let's get them. Same thing. I think we'll do a we'll do a chicken farm. Deliver those over there. Egg supply not meeting demand. You want more eggs? More eggs it is. Like that. And then we'll have, uh, I guess across the street here, we'll put in the other one. Sampa. Do a big one. And again, so that does count. I think that. Um, this has to go to a mill. I think I can get away with doing it like uh, that. And then, like, you go there. Okay. Done. Copper mine connected to the, to the road system. Um. Build mine. But I put my fields there. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Uh, we need a road over here. Okay. Get some yaks to start copper production. Alright, yaks. Let's put these guys, like, um, over here somewhere. Again. One big yak land. Three should be hopefully enough. Uh, we'll give them a road. Now we have yaks. Cool. Uh, have commodities power with 40 artisans in range. Copper extraction up and running. We should use it to make utensils in the coppersmith workshop. So we need to get this guy, the commodity supplier, which has to, he's going to need to be within range of the houses. So we'll supply like over there. And then we need to make this guy, who's going to be the coppersmith. He actually can't make it to over here. I don't think if he... I don't know if he actually can make it over there. Does he have to be here? I think he does. He's not in range of this thing, though. I know how to adjust this. I remember this. So the mine goes to this guy, which then goes to there. And there is... Let's see if it'll let me do it. Put him there. So he's got to go there. And then he has to go over here, but he can't actually reach there. And so we can put in, like, points along the way. I may not have them unlocked for me yet, though. Hey, Samurai. I wonder if I can do... I can try getting a road over here. Does the, uh, does the other road... A tamped road, is that going to do me any good? Will that increase my range? No. Of 
I'll have to move this guy. Let's set him like there. We'll get the road. And that should work. And you go there, and then you go there. Okay. Hey, so Sir Mark, how's it going? All right, enough utensils for everyone. A coppersmith uses only one unit of copper, means a single mine can have a multiple workshops. There's the carrier post. That's that's the one I needed before. Okay, so we'll get this guy. We'll set him right there. I wonder if I can put him, get away with putting him there. Let me, let me try. Just fit in there so nicely. Oh, 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 oh. Um, oh, okay, I see, I see. So I have to go to a carrier, okay, so right, right, right. Go to a carrier post, and then get distributed wherever it needs to go. I'll move him back, back over where I had him. So this needs to go... There. And then you go there, and there, and there. Okay. Got an idea, yeah? Let's expand higher. Climbing middle zones of the mountains is just perfect for bees and honey. Operational shaft going up. I see a lot of snow up there. Something's about to get blasted with snow. Okay, we will go right about there and up. Like that. Beekeeper is one of the most built one of the buildings whose productivity depends on the mountain zone you place it in. So I need we need two operational beekeepers. Do they, do they link up like everyone else? Oh, they don't. Okay. Okay, you need workers, and you need... Um, are you out of range of the workers? Is that a problem? You have them, but you don't. Missing some lowlander workers. Does that do it? That do it. That doesn't do it. Hmm. Oh, I know. oh, you know, maybe we need, maybe we need them from over here, like these guys. These are the lowlanders. We don't need artisans. We need lowlanders. Lowlanders. May want. What do you want? Satisfaction level dropped below current upgrade requirements. How? Oh. Don't worry, I'll get you some bees. Has a flaw, perfect place for bees. Act like you're stung by one. Open your eyes. How are we gonna transport this stuff all down? Um, there's a solution. Increase research level of your town and get access to more advanced buildings. Build a scholarship facility such as an academy. There's the monks. We want an academy that the monks will work. Can I set this up here with the bees? And then we'll set up the monk houses this way. Like that. And like that. Uh, the bees, I'm assuming, need to go into one of... Uh, one of... Where were those things at? One of these. Maybe it'll tell me how to get it down. That's probably what that's probably what we're doing here. Throw him over there for now. That is the monks there. 
They need to go live over there, but we don't have enough of them. Monk dormitories. Okie doke. There we go. Lots of monk dormitories. Satisfaction and supply are low. So we got a lot of unemployed artisans. Um, a lot of unemployed lowlanders. No unemployed monks yet. How many people does this um, need? We don't, have enough, we don't have enough money. Is that the problem? Monks are not in, are they not in range? Is that the problem? That's not it. What am I, what am I missing? Academy. Give them a praying place. Okay, do we need to have a, um, a food market up here for these guys? Some of, them are, some of them are out of range. No way of like getting things. That's, that's the point, I guess. We can't. We don't have things get, uh, moving. So let's do a market there, and then we got to get it's like the bees need to go deliver over there. Not in range, huh? You should be in range, actually. There you go. This is actually the wrong side then. Put it there. Let me see what happens if I try that. Does that work? Not enough utensil supply now. Yeah, they're getting, they're not getting the utensils supplied, which I can fix. I don't know how much you're actually bringing in. You're producing four. You're receiving one to make five. Do I need another one of these? Or do I have to have... I want to go into that one and that one. Uh, where do you need to go? Oh. You... Yeah, you go... there. Oh, not in range. Such a tiny range. Um, I need like one... It's one away. Okay, I'm gonna pave a road. Maybe I shouldn't. I can't... I guess I can't do those. Put it, I can't put it there because then... Yeah, maybe I probably can. There, and then and then he goes there. Okay. The number of population each population class is how many free workers you have, not total. Do I need... Two more monks. Ah, okay. Just didn't have enough monks. It's a lot of monks. Monk! I need a monk! Resource level one, you get access to the cart post. 
Carts are not designed to transport teenage humans, or teenage yaks for that matter, no matter how long they've been at the inn. Send multiple resources... Send resources to multiple targets, buildings, over long distances. Use it to send honey down to my artisans and finally upgrade their houses. I'd love to. Does it not go up? Oh, yeah. So this one's going to go there. So now the honey goes there. And there. And then you go there. Hooray! What's that all about? What's up with you? What's with the star? You mean you love this place? Okay, nice and dumb. Seems some groundwork. Yeah, ready to continue our quest to travel to the first real mountain. High enough for a summit temple. A logistics point down here. More importantly, a way to secure our financial situation. Yeah, we need money. Start getting donations from citizens. A donation spot. Yeah, you know what? I like money. Let's go over here. This is a good spot for a trading post. Easy to send resources further from here. What's that noise? Oh, I wonder what that is. This avalanche wasn't even that huge. I bet we can still have a trading post in this region. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, basic way of blocking avalanches is to put trees in the way. We can do it using foresters. Foresters block avalanches. Okay, do There we go. There's an avalanche free zone. An operational trading post. Free from avalanches. Just throw it there. It needs need yaks. Missing yaks. So I want this guy to go like we'll put him around there. We need a bridge to connect these two. Okay. I don't think my robe was in the avalanche free zone, but hopefully that's okay. I can transport it anywhere. Are you supposed to go? Are you supposed to send this stuff over here? Is that what the idea is? No. Yeah, so that's. This isn't protected from avalanches, but everything else is. Fully protected. Is it not fully protected? Do you want me to make a whole bunch of these? Okay. Do I want to uh, block that? Can I get any more than that? We just need more yaks, I think. Or have yaks required any more yaks? Yaks are down here. Oh, uh, there. Here we go. Okay. Yaks. Done. Here it comes. Kind of have to wait for me to put some trees in. Okay. From the beginning, there's nothing to worry about. Finally, we're ready to move on. Let's make our way to the first real mountain. Why can't we just live here? Okay, where do we want to go? Now we have a choice. We can, we can go anywhere. We got wind slab, rocky features, making dealing with avalanches a real challenge. And they come as powerful as ever from the very start. Get some warm clothes. This is copper and gold. Able to export 
Butter lamps. Delicious. I think. Export fish and salt. Oh, I don't know where to go. What do you have? You got crystals, splintered soul. What's the uh, what's that little leaf mean? Good for a start. Limited space with not much fertile ground for farming requires careful planning. That makes it sound like it's an easy one, but then that... Oh, because it has some good... Everything you need for establishing a proper settlement. This this talon top seems like a good one. No green zones. There's a balanced one. Butter tea. Gold. Oh, I don't know. Um, let's go with... We got Mount Plenty. Avalanche is standard. This is our... Let's, let's stick with uh, Mount Plenty. That seems nice. This one looks cool. Mount Plenty sounds like my style. Uh, I'll go with Adept. Hey, Helifax. How's it going? All right, now we get to now we get to go without our hand being held. This man's enormous. This is a good thing. We'll find everything we need to establish a prosperous town, and then build the greatest summit temple of all. I like it. A lot of rivers. Okay, enough talk. Let's get to work. Okay. This is pretty cool. It looks like there's three, three, is there three levels of this thing? I think so. Okay, well, we'll start down here. This one's way down here. Let's start, yeah, this is where we need to start. Okay. Now, let's get some lowlander huts. Uh, we'll start with the first thing. We'll get the, uh, the food mark here, and I guess it needs to be pretty centralized. Okay. Yeah. Uh, we'll have the houses on the one side, and we'll put business stuff on the other. Food stuff. Sixteen huts. Um, maybe we shouldn't go that big just yet. We gotta feed all these people. Okay. Um, I'll go ahead and put it. I'm, I'm gonna put it in there. Just because. Um, is it? In, is everything in range? Everything's in range. Good. Let's get some food, which we'll do. I guess we'll do. Uh, we'll do some chickens. And what I could do is kind of plan this to where I've got a carrier post. I think each carrier post holds a different thing. that because you take everything to there right I think that right oh, I, my bot didn't go away I turned my bot off, bot off and it's still going wait a minute why don't you listen bot don't hold shift to make multiple things it doesn't work we'll do two chickens Okay, I want you to take your stuff, send your stuff there, and then you send your stuff there. Okay, yeah, that's, that's Chicken Man. So we'll set up, the other food guy we'll do is Sampa. I think we can pile that one in here. It won't connect real pretty, but it, it'll, it'll work. I think I can do that. We'll do a lot of this stuff. And then that, and they all connect up. Hmm, that doesn't actually reach. Well, that's a problem. If I move you one square, you still work? And I put a new one in. Oh, it still doesn't work? Does that work? 
barley and, and, and hay. Oh, it doesn't. Oh, yeah, half finished. Right, right, right. Because then that, that needs to go into uh, whatever the other one, the, this guy, the mill. And I might need a couple mills, I guess. I can't rotate things. What if I know of? It's all going to go in that one, isn't it? So. Is that how I want to do it? Yeah. So it'll go to there, and then I'll go into there. So you bring in 24, and you produce 12. What, what, what each of these? Each of these are six. The thirties coming in, and then the twenty-four going out. So we got a little, we got like a field extra. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what was the other food that we had? Um, cheese. Yak shack. Okay. How's the how's the houses looking? They want food. They don't have enough food. You've got Sampa need, but you need another another type of food. Do the chicken eggs not have not happening? Maybe not enough. We also need an enlight oh yeah, enlightenment. So now, um, why don't you have enlightenment? What do you mean you don't have enlightenment? It's right there. It affects 40 citizens. Why does it say they're not enlightened? Yeah, it says they want cheese. Baths and utensils. Hmm. I'm not sure. Well, that's not working. Over here? Yeah, yeah. You can watch that watch that step there. Dangerous. Donation spot. I would like some money, please. Oh, maybe maybe um, artisans need to work that place. Maybe that's the problem. Now, if I were to put an artisan house like over here, does that solve any problems? See, they have, they have the oh, they have a praying place, but they need enlightenment. Which enlightenment is not a praying place. They need, I guess, an academy. I'm not sure what that is. I did it before, didn't I? I thought it was it was that. So these guys are happy. Okay. Right. Um, well, we'll get... We can go... I don't know if we, we can go up there and do our cow stuff. We'll probably fit it over here, though. I can put one of these guys there so all the cow farms can, can go to him. And he can make it to the food place. It shows satisfied needs. It needs incense. Oh, okay. There we go. Summit Temple and Mandala. Yak Guardian. Okay. Let's get some cheese for these the good people over here. Two of these are going to go into that guy. Money balance negative. Okay, 
I can go there and then put the cheese guy in the middle. Yeah. Okay. Now, cheese has been delivered. Cheese is fulfilled. Hey, Unity, how's it going? So they've got to upgrade. We need an enlightenment one, which would be a mandala. Mandala? Mandala? There it is. I need six monks in order to run that. But monks, I think we're going to have to put them. We can put them, I guess. We can put them down here. Like, we can make this all just, like, one big house land. Is that, is that still able to reach where I want it to? Okay. And then we need the academy, or the... Um, Research level one, but we have to get the academy first to get research, right? Uh, hell. Okay. Well, it's not coming for me. This takes 48 monks. That's a lot of monks. And I feel like maybe our monks should live on a different level. Maybe the academy can be up here and the monks can be kind of around it. I suppose it will... Was it four for each one? Yeah. I don't know, do I want to put it in there? I, I like the gold house. Or the, yeah, it's cool. Let's put it up here. Money balance negative. We'll go from here. To there. Okay, it seems like they can. Yeah, that's not a bit. That's close enough. It's not a big deal. So, put the rest of these guys sort of. I think actually maybe around here because this is where a food place is. So we'll keep them kind of nearby. How do I know if it's in range of this thing? Okay, that's all up in range. That is how many? How many we got? That's four in each one. That's Twenty, forty. We need what? Forty-eight in here. Man, that's a lot of monks. Okay, they want more cheese. Monks need cheese. Is he the only one considered living in range? Did I do something, did I do something wrong? Do these monks need to be all up there? I think they might. I think it does need to all be up this way. So they've got the cheese and everything else met. But it... Where it is, they're not in range. I already built it. I'm going to put them out here. Oh, now only those are in range. I put this... Okay. Let's set this guy over here. Was it actually working? Is it working where it was? Only 24 citizens are affected, which is going to be... It looks like it's only hitting that one. So 
So only you have access to it. No one else actually has the access, gets the perk for it. So yeah, it's better, it's better elsewhere. Let me get a little more cheese here. And then we'll come back and fix that. There's the honey production, which does have to be up, up higher. Okay, there's cheese. Are you making cheese fast enough? Oh, 27's coming in. Okay, so we need another cheese maker. And their cheese makers are important. Blessed are the cheese makers. I'm out of space. Okay, so then you are going to go here instead. There we go. So you're bringing in 18, you're bringing in 9. So yeah, okay, okay. I see. We need like 1 to 1 basically on these things. Hey, wasp! Thank you for the raid. <clears throat> um, I'll stop wasting some money on workarounds and fix the underlying problems, he says. Yeah, you hush. Okay, so we're going to move this. I think. So the research, make sure I got this right. I understood this right. Do I now... Can I, can I do that now? How do I, how do I un... Oh, I can undo that. I can do it now. And that would make a lot of people happy. In fact, I could just do that and probably put a road right there. And that hits every one of these houses, so they've got it. Need satisfied. Need satisfied. Need satisfied. What do I need? I need a bath and a utensil in range. My money! All right. Hey, new folks. Um, <laughs> you just lost. Okay. Uh, okay. Let me let me load. That's only two minutes ago. I'm gonna load right there. Let me see if I can if we can fix this. I can fix this. So let's look at money. I'm bringing 300 bucks from the capital. Donations 268. My upkeep is too much. I also have a missing workforce penalty, which I don't... That's not a good thing. So let me see if I can move this around. Let's pause and fix this. So they're going to put you up there. And every single one of these is going to get moved. And they're going to live right over here next to this fella. Um, I should probably leave a space there. Is there a shortcut? No. That we'll put a road in here. Let me go get the number roads in. Like that. So they've got a road there. We'll do a road there. They're going to whine about not having any food. Those babies. Um, that. And they're going to need like a market. We need a market up here. This hopefully will fix that, that low workforce penalty. This is called Lesara Summit Kingdom. Sorry, sorry, Raiders. I, I'm distracted here. Lesara Summit Kingdom. So we're building multiple towns here, basically, on the side of a mountain. There's avalanches all around. Um, there's uh, people that really want cheese. Let's see if we can solve these problems here. I'll give you a, I'll give you a little tour here in just a second. Okay. This may not be salvageable. I may need to come back and start this over. Those will go like that. Okay. They want... Well, they want food. You... Oh, okay. So I'm here. I'm going to move ahead and move this guy. And set him... Here, and I'll put a um, what's that? The cheese maker. 
Cheese Man can be right there. So then you just go there, you go there. Can't receive anything. Oh, not you. Not you. Food guy. There. Okay, so now they've got food. They got food. They got science. Am I still... I got a minus 630 missing workforce penalty. Do I? Let me give you a look. Okay, so we're building a town on these, these platforms. There's my first platform. We're building our ramp up here, trying to get our second platform going. We can zoom out and see the whole place. Eventually, we will, you know, colonize this whole place if I don't die. Uh, there's some, you see some copper up there. There's some, like, rock crystals around on the other side over here. Um, those patches of snow will avalanche every once in a while and make it real bad. There we go. I'm trying to figure out how to n not how to fix this missing workforce penalty. I need lowlanders and yaks. Where do you? S oh, there it is. So I need. I have 64 and I need 81. Is that what I was trying to say? Okay. Oh, okay. So it, okay, there it is. Don't have enough workers in the city. Additional ones will be contracted, which is super expensive. There we go. And we need it. We need an artisan, of course. We're still at minus 460 because... I don't know. Maybe it'll fix in a second. That. And then we're missing a bunch of yaks. Yeah. The yaks, I think we might move up here. Okay. Now any more lowlanders because of that. Do I want to put any over here? I don't know that I want to. I think I want to keep them around this one because this is where... I understand why we want to focus artisans and all that because they're going to want different things. Like that. So ideally maybe these guys need to move. I'll set them in. Here. Okay. I want cheese now. Positive cash flow. Hot dog. Okay. So these guys don't care about cheese. Oh, they do care about cheese. So these guys really like cheese. So now that we've got that, money's positive. Now I should be able to make this thing for everyone. And I, I, I used my spot where I was going to put it. I can't get it where I can get where I can reach everyone now. It reaches all but those two. Oh, such a good spot over there. Okay. I'm moving you. Is that the right spot? Is that where I want that one to go? Let me just... Pause real quick. Set it over... Oh, no, there. Really, there's a, certainly a puzzle element here trying to get these things to, to line up right. I can put it there... Doesn't really solve any. It's not helping anything out. Um, if I move up, I can put it there. If I move that one house, and then I can add in one house. No big deal. So I will put it. Oh, you know what? Doesn't reach those up there. Was it not the biggest? Not the biggest deal if it doesn't reach those. Let me check something out. If I were to put it there. Yeah, that's no good. That's no good. We kind of want to build around these things. Something like that. Okay. You. Um, come be... Oh, there. So a bit of workforce penalty because we don't have enough monks.
Okay. Uncollected donations, which is outrageous. Uh, do you monks like a, like praying places? I would think you would like that. That seems like a monk kind of thing. What do you want? You want uh, you want the same thing, mandala. You want to cl enclose my monastery walls, and you want to be a, or you want to be in a higher zone, which I'm not. I'm not doing. Okay, monks like being up there. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm dealing. I'm dealing with lowlanders right now. How are we doing? So honey, provide honey from the market. Honey does need to be a little higher. Satisfaction too low. Yeah, I'm kind of mad about things. We need to set you back over here for now while we while I figure things out because that they can be supplied happily over here. Plenty of cheese over here. Okay, and I'm, I'm going to give you another artisan just to save that a little bit. There we go. Oh, you need more cheese. You know, I did all that cheese making, cheese moving, uh, though they like cheese too. So I've got both of you guys coming here making cheese. Oh no, I never solved that cheese problem. I got, I only have one cheese maker over here. I need, I need another cheese maker. I can't talk about cheesemakers without thinking of Life of Brian. <laughs> um, let me bump you back a little bit. Like that. Okay. Give me a cheesemaker there. So I'm going to put you there, you there, you there. So now we're getting we're getting plenty of milk to supply the cheese. <laughs> Blessed be the cheese makers. Supply too low over here. You're not enough cheese. Man, there's really not enough cheese around here. I suppose I could do what um, two yak shacks and three cheese makers would be ideal. All right, you people want cheese. Here's your dang cheese. That doesn't really work though because it needs to go into a um, into this fella, and he will distribute it accordingly. So then you need to go. Ooh, complicated there, and you go there, and then you distribute to that one, that one, and that one, and then they go in there. Okay, there's gonna be so much cheese over here, and lowlanders need to work it. Missing what? Missing yaks. Okay, let's road ya. Okay. Oh, look. More of these guys. Okay, now, what do you need? You need honey. And honey has to be up here. So let's go get... I'm assuming that counts as honey land. Also need to get these artisans. Which I haven't even messed with artisans yet. They're going to have to go on another, another place. Um, I may even just make a whole new artisan land over here somewhere. Can I bridge from there to there? No, we have to go... Okay. But we can do it there. That could, That's... That's artisan style, and then the honey can come up up this way, like that. Connect the road up. Perspective is weird over here, isn't it? Ooh, that's strange. Seeing it like that. 
Um, okay, and then let's just do a road like that. It's fine. And this is going to be artisan land. Artisan land needs food. It's not going to be real big. What do artisans want? You put one in and see what they want. You want... Well, you want food. Uh, you like cheese. Sampa and eggs. Can I find a way of getting it delivered up there easily? This is tricky. I almost need to make me make a whole new one of... Um, I can't have room to, like, fit anything else over there. Can I, like, distribute it? These won't distribute. But, like, if one of these cheese folks can make their way up here... That'd satisfy a cheese need. There's no space over here. Is that a bridge I need to make? Yeah, it's, it's, gonna, it's, so, it's so tiny. This isn't going to work. It's too small. Really, this should probably be around here because that's where mine is. I could come back. I guess I could combine them. Let me save that for right now. Let me uh, let me put the artisans over here. They can live up somewhere over this way. Is that reachable? No. That is. A little bit of it is. Okay, so you can live over here. You get your dang cheese. You don't get anything else. But you get your cheese. They're not getting their eggs or their sampa either. Which is down here. What do I do? I guess I could I could move them here, another row of them there, just to keep them all uh, happy. Because I need them, I need them to give me utensils. I think they work the honey things too. Oh, here we go. We can go straight straight from here. Okay, and this is where we're going to put the honey. Honey production up this way. I wonder how um, feasible it is to do something like this. Not really put any people up here and just put them onto... What was the... Um, this one. And then you go... Okay. Can you go that way? You can go that far. Can you go... Um, can you go down here? You can go that far. Oh, okay, so that changes some things. Okay, that makes a big difference. So we can go... If we can do that, that, that makes a big difference. Okay. Let's level them up. Done. Hooray! Listen up, the mountain has almost everything we need to make ourselves feel at home here. Take time and effort, but we can scale up here like nowhere else. It's decided, full steam ahead. First time I've seen you enthusiastic since we arrived in these mountains. I have a clear vision. Okay. Reach 680 people. We need a couple more artisans. I think I'm gonna make... I'm gonna try to fit as much in this spot over here, I think, as I can. Which isn't too many more. That's a few of it anyway. I have a bunch of unemployed lowlanders now. Because because of, of, that's all big. Uh, we can get the copper deposit. What will give us? We need to do this now. So I'll just stash that over there. 
And this needs to go into... So this is where we need to go into what we was doing before. So we've got... Copper utensil production. So the mine goes into a copper smith. But we want to go... Because the mine makes more stuff. What do you make? Four of these things. And you... Take one to make five. So we need a couple of these. Maybe like four of them. So this then goes here. So I could probably use a trade post over here also, or really anywhere. A cart post. And then deliver that down the mountain also. Assuming you can reach over there. That goes over there. Well, um, I got, I'm trying to, I'm trying to stay happy here, but I, I got some sad news. My, uh, my pet mouse, Elvis, died last night. He was caught in a trap. Anyway, anyway, I'll try to keep it together. Woo, woo, woo. Avalanche! There it goes. Yeah, <laughs> he couldn't walk out. <laughs> okay, so that's working there. I got sidetracked with that. Uh, with, with, with my mouse. Um, we want... Don't hit shift. I'm trying to hit shift to build multiples. We want a couple of these. We deliver to commodity supp like what? Oh, what's a commodity supplier? Um, what was what is a commodity? That's not you. Yeah, it's an Elvis song. Food markets. What do they go into? Baskets. This one. It goes into the coppersmith. They make they make the utensils, but then where do they go? Where do I take them to then? Commodity supplier. That works, I think. That works even better. Okay, we need a lot more artisans now. I'm gonna pause because I'm broke. What do you want now? Not enough utensils. It's never in, no, not enough food. Never ending cycle. How come you don't have enough food, but everyone, oh, it doesn't actually reach up there. Ooh. Okay, and then you, utensils not supply, not enough, not enough. Need another one of these. Um, you're bringing in four, and you're only taking two of them out, so we actually have two more of these. Okay, more artisans and more yaks. I guess I'm gonna have to put them over here. I don't want to. Suspicious Minds, that's the name of it, yeah. You know, all my years of listening to oldies would, would come in handy one day. I knew it. I'm running out of space. Just like Elvis. Hmm. 
Okay, and my yaks. Yaks live up here. everything I need. I just need more people now. The more people needs, I'm going to need more supplies and things. I might be able to move this over to the side. Like, these guys, if I can scooch them over. And this probably can't move much. Yeah, you can move stuff and it's, it's necessary. It's definitely a puzzle placement game. Like that, and that's still in range. Are you still in range? If I move you like over here, are they still in range? You're not in range. Get back where you belong. Okay, there's a little bit of a hole there. I'm not sure I can do much more with, with all that stuff. I can add in a bit more of the barley. I can do more barley, which if I need it, I don't know that I need it just yet. I will, I'm sure soon. What do you want? You want uh, a bath and not satisfied. a bath and another enlightenment, which doesn't tell me what you actually want. Summit Temple will do it. But let's get you let's get you a bath. Where's the bath at? There's a monastery wall, which is what the guys up there want. Oh, you just want one of those? Like, does it actually wall? Oh, it actually walls. Oh, cool. Does it actually need to be all around you? You want walls around the house. But then I gotta move the house. I gotta put walls. It's gonna be a pain. A real pain. How do I do that with a road? Is it because it crossed the road? Okay. I need to move this one. Okay. Let's see if I can. Let's see if I can do this. That one can't be there anymore. Can I have one there? I don't know if I can do that either. Just tell, tell me about these walls before I start doing this. Uh, nope. Yeah, the monks, they want to be... They want to be um, higher on the high zone, so ideally the monks would go a little higher. So I'm gonna be doing this unnecessarily, but we can make we can make more monks later on. Let's see if we can satisfy this need, though. This is an easy need to satisfy, I think. Oh, I say easy. Every house is gonna have to get moved back. Let's go down there. Ever, okay, I'm just going to have to lose a couple houses. Yeah. Just go up there for now. Um, I want to go there. Wall. Okay, there you go, you're enclosed. Does that make you happy? It does make you happy. If you get, um, if you get honey, 
you and eggs. You don't have honey and eggs? No, because they're down. Oh, well, honey we haven't got yet. It's up there. Can I, um, I could have a second one of these, I guess, and have it deliver, because you can't do two, multiple ones. And have it delivered down here, so these guys could have it. And that would make my monks better. Oops. That. We'll row it around it. And all three of these, we'll put a second one of those in. These are kind of expensive to upkeep, but I'm making good money. Oh, not in range. Ugh. I don't know if I need three of them going there. Maybe this one, maybe I'll change this, this one to go there. And then these two can go to that one. And then he will go to that market. Hey, upgrade monks! Woo! That's how we get more stuff. If we can get these artisans upgraded, that's... That'd be great. They need a prosperity thing, which would be beer, a bath, or a decoration. Where is the bath? Baths. I can do them right now. We just need a river nearby. There ain't no rivers. Way over there. So far. Oh, it has to actually be there. Do I have any other rivers around? No. Do they want to live next to that? I'm assuming that has a range, and that's not actually not actually not going to work. Yeah, that has a range there, so that's that's not going to work. Now, if I move everything over there. What's there, is there an easier one? Uh, in range of a decorative building. Oh, hey, that is something I can do. Forget forget the baths. Disable the baths. It's too expensive. We'll come back there. So if we give you a decorative building, like... What's a decorative building? Ooh, look at the monastery stuff. Okay. Where are the decorative buildings at? constitutes decorative building. Distribution, avalanche protection, treasury, resources. Um, what's a decorative building? Yakutopia. We need a lot more people. Well, I think the next step is going to be... Hmm. I suppose there's not really reason, any reason to not go a ways away. Means the decorations in the prosperity menu. Um. In this, in this menu? Oh, prosperity. Okay. Oh, right there. I got a flower pot. I missed those. Does that satisfy your needs? It does. So what do I need to get you? So you've got all those filled out. What do I need to get them up to the next one? Does it have to, do I have to satisfy every one of these to get them up there? Or does he need... I 
If those are all filled in. You're not in range of utensils. Fill the bar with fulfilled needs to make the folks live in there. We want to upgrade their housing. Oh, so if I just do one of anything, it'll do it. Okay. So if I give you a praying place. That's over there. That's too far away. But a praying place. I think I can do that right, right there. There we go. Okay. 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 Dropped because we don't have enough stuff now. Okay, so we're short on Sampa. I can do that. Is there a duplicate button? I wish there was a duplicate button. Can I fit any more of these in here? No. Well, this is a real problem. I could do, you know what? I think I'm going to make a whole, just like a whole Samp of land. I think that would be an easier way of doing it. Like that. And then we can move all the Sampa up there. And we'll just send it out. It has to go to uh, a mill and all that, you know, but that's easy, easily done. Am I paused? Yeah. We'll do a gap. Um, and then we'll just make this. This is going to be Som Sampa Flats or something. We'll think of something creative. And then in the center, we'll have it all collected up or baked or whatever it does. There, uh, we need the the distributor. This guy. We'll go there. That should be fine. We need to. We can move it. Okay. Um, all this stuff has to go into. Is it just that that and then into the into the baker the mill. I want to do this here. And then all of them will go to that. Is this going to be too much? Or will they distribute this fine? And then all this stuff is going to go into here. This guy goes into there, and then he goes down there. Okay, but we need more. Because it's getting so, so... Are you only sending out 24? Do I need... Yeah. Yeah. No, no, no. Okay, so... What, two more of those? This is, like a, this is a math game. Boy. Boy. Ah, what's your range? Okay. So now... You got 72 coming in, 72 going out, going to here, heading down 
this away. Done. Okay, and I think we gotta move Cheese Land and put it somewhere else. Somewhere else as well. We can put Cheese Land on another one. We got all, enough of these places. One of these small ones would be fine. This could easily be Cheese Land. Cheese Land, but that would be fine. And then we can send the cheese wherever it needs to go. I've got multiple cheese spots. But we could send it down here. And then we make this low, all the low end on their artisans can be, be down here in their happy land. Um, yeah. So, cheese land. My favorite land. These folks think cheese is a necessity. I find cheese to be a necessity as well. Okay, and then we'll just put you guys up over here. And that one. And then I need that one too, don't I? No, that's the chicken farm one. Oh yeah, I got the chicken farms too. I can again I can move those. Okay, so I need I think it's three of these for every two. But it needs to go into Do I have this set up right? I don't, because I don't have a cheese, not that one. I don't have a cheese hut over here. Is that what you are? You're a cheese hut. You're gonna watch your steps. There. I'm just gonna cancel these. Okay, and then we'll get a trade hut. Centrally located trade hut, I think it's fine. Do I get this backwards? He's going to... Yeah, you go into there. And you go into here. Where are you going? What I, what I do? Um, oh yeah. So you go to there, and there. You go to there, and there. Cheese go there. Still short on cheese? More cheese! What's wrong with you? What's that question mark mean? Not enough resources to send. I know. I understand. So we have tons of milk coming in. <clears throat> 27 milk coming in. <clears throat> and only only 12 going out. So we can actually have two more cheese makers. Think you can reach over there? And we'll play it safe. We'll put one there. We'll try it. Get your whoop, a road. There we go. Cheese solved. Oh yeah. Okay, we're running a little low on yaks. We're almost at the population that we need. There's a lot of yaks around here, and yaks is another thing that really doesn't matter where they're at. They don't have a range. It can really be anywhere. And so I could have like giant yak land down there. Or really anywhere. That's that big spot over there can be it. Because yaks are pretty big. Let me set them over there. I'm sorry, I got my bot. Let me, let me fix my bot real quick. Um, it's uh, bugging me. I thought I turned it off. Maybe I didn't. One second. Okay, there we go. All right. 
So I think, yeah, I think we make this just one big... That's a big spot. That's a lot of yaks we could have over there, but we need a lot of yaks. We need 50 of them. And each of these are holding... Five. Provide you with ready and health, healthy and ready to work yaks. And they don't need anything. I don't think. Like, if I put these yaks over here, are they happy? Pause work. They need a road, of course. We need a way down there. Um, we'll have to have the, we'll have the bridge and then and then go down. Research how you get better yak buildings. Okay. You can connect up there too. That's actually all connected now. We'll bridge over here. Okay, yaks connected. You know what a yak sounds like? Yak sounds like a cow. Makes sense, I suppose. What's the difference between a yak and a cow? Or a bovine. Linking them over. I don't know. This provokes. <clears throat> this makes five. I don't think it makes a difference. Other than the roads only need to link up one of them. As far as I know. Yeah. Yeah, get a yak over here. Praise Jack Tinti. <laughs> Oops. So yeah, see, that, that that doesn't have road connected. That one does. So that's I suppose that's that's a benefit. Okay, I am short. One yak. Here we go, yak solved. I'm gonna go yak crazy. We need people to work these places, that's fine. Let's yak. So many yaks. Okay. And now... I need to make room for this. I think I'm going to move my chicken farms. We'll send them over here for now. They're going to get moved elsewhere soon. And this is kind of a mess over here. So, like, we don't need, like, all these roads over here. They're just causing problems. And we can have a row, uh, a row of these fellas over this way. short on some people. Uh, what do you need to upgrade? You don't have that thing over there. Which is, a, is it Mandela? Is that how you say that? Man Mandala? There we go. Um, you don't have a utensil. Why can't you read the... Oh, you can't reach the utensil shop. This guy. Um, You could if you were living there. Okay. A lot of people. Hey, Queen Luna the Hedgehog. How's it going? And hello. Uh, well, I say hello, Sam Lori. Sam Lori, you've been here a while. What are you carrying? Oh, utensils. Carrying utensils in. Oh, look at that. I haven't paid any attention to this. It says those are the those are the utensils we're making. Oh, they're coming down. The, oh, look at that. I haven't made any, paid any attention. This is great. Hmm. 
riding the chairlifts. I've been pestering my grandma to take me up on her chairlift. And um, I think she's going to take me up on it. I'm sorry. <clears throat> I'm sorry. We need more houses. I need um, maybe a road here and then a bunch of houses can come down this way. Now, one question about the, you know, one thing about the houses, maybe, maybe. Let me see if this works. Let me remove all these. Um, can I move you on this side? Get these chickens pushed even further away. Oh, no. Too, too far. Good. Um, let's say... Let's do a test. <clears throat> if I put that road there and I put one there, that is that is not connected to both roads. So the houses still need individual connections. Okay. Let's put some more of these in. You are short on... Are you out of range of this guy? Yeah. So that's not really... A good place for you to be. That's not good either. Yeah, I'm out of space. <clears throat> that guy didn't get a decoration. Probably doesn't need to be next to a road. I thought that works. Okay, almost there. 50 more. <clears throat> is it online that I tell terrible dad jokes, or it just has it also infected my regular, infected my regular life? My wife doesn't doesn't think they're funny. I don't get I don't get any sort of reaction. I get a <laughs> I I still tell him though. That doesn't let that dissuade me. <clears throat> Occasionally I get a uh Did you tell that on your stream? That's that's usually that's usually my uh, the response I get. That's good enough. That's good enough. It doesn't have to be a good reaction. Just as long as it's a reaction. <laughs> oh, you're not good enough for... What is wrong with you? Oh, you're out of range of that. Uh, okay. I don't want you there then. I'm out of space. Can I put one of you? That one's out of range of a lot of things. Is it? Oh, for the next the next level. Okay, so let's throw in... Can I put that in there? It's out of range of... of the utensils. It doesn't reach there. That's out of range of food. Okay, well, you won't go there. Uh, I'll just toss you out there for now. <clears throat> okay, well, that's about as big as I can I can get us until I get the next. So we need two more things. So if we bring in... They want baths. These guys want baths. In range of a service providing facility. I can't do that, though, unless I, like, move the whole town over here. I can't do that. There's got to be something else I can do. It does have a lot of rivers. Really, just just the one though, isn't it? No, there's one. Of, oh, there's one over there. So we could like build over here, 
and upgrade again. There's some over there too. We just chose poorly, I guess. Well. Hmm. These are looking okay. And I could do another monastery patch right here probably pretty easily. I think if I if I come in here and I do some of these walls, that'll give me my people that I need. side of the walls. I don't really need any monks. Maybe I shouldn't be doing this because I don't need them. I don't need every need. I don't need the highlighted needs because they don't have, not these, but these guys, they only have that one. So can it be any, it can be any food. I said that's the only one I have. A, oh, okay, so that's the only one I have a, the ability to do. I get it. Okay, I get it. To get, so Academy gets us to level one research. How do we get to level 2 research? Is it a second monastery? Oh, it is a monastery. Not a, Okay, I see. Okay. Monastery versus academy. These, though, they don't actually need to be next to the houses. Provide scholarship to the houses in range is all it does, but it doesn't actually do anything else other than that. That purple mean it's going to level it up? What does that mean? Why was it purple? Oh. Put my monks over on this side. Input resources is you need you need Painted cedar. I don't even know what that is. Let me, let me um, remove that for right now. Can I just do a second academy? What do I want to do a second academy? What's that going to give me? I get a gong. I'll get yak races. <laughs> I want yak races. I do have 40 monks, so I could do an academy and m m mostly get them under control. I was going to just house that in, but that's actually not going to be very many houses. I guess it'll be, it'll be a small little batch of houses there. What I could do... This might mess with my system here. that and then we'll wall in all of this area okay okay we'll have to get a road in here can I just put a road in without it messing up monastery houses Change that a little bit. Okay, and then the road will go through there. You're not in range of... Why not?
These guys are good, but these guys are not. Um, oh, I bet you they're gonna make him. Here we go. One guy is out of is out of the loop. One guy. Well, there you go. Okay. So now they still need they still need something. Academy nearby, which I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put it right over there if it fits. It does fit. It won't be actually nearby, but it will if I put a road in there. Um, did I mess something up here? Invalid path from... Oh, the mine. About over there. The road goes through there. Huh? Reaches that spot here. I'll move you. Yeah, upgraded roads. Yeah. But I don't know how to make those yet. Do I? Oh, I do know how to make those. Why did I think I didn't know how to make those? Okay. Not collected donations. I forgot about that. I need money. Give me my money. Where do I get that at? Where's the, the, the money money picker upper? This guy. Yeah, so much money is just... I'm just not picking up so much money. These monks need to pay. I'm glad it saves, like, it doesn't, like, reset everything whenever you move it. So I don't have to go in and reset it, replant all my plots. That would be a, a nightmare. Treasury, this guy, and that. There we go. Now, fi donations 15. I'm making so much money now. And then we're going to get this academy. Pluck it in right about there. In the middle will be nicer. I don't think there's any way of doing it easily. Okay, upgrade you folks. Here we go. We have somebody who doesn't have what they want. What do you want? Uh, what did I miss out on? What, what's happening? Missing out on utensils? What's what's with these guys? What did, what did I just lose from them? Did they lose their food? There's plenty of food. I can give them a praying place. Fixes that. I have to get another house there. Okay. Building upkeep is it, building upkeep is expensive, but we did it. Very good. We have to address the housing situation immediately. What's wrong with it? How's uh, high quality living living conditions? This is the backbone of every prosperous town. I really want a prosperity, so let's get to work. Forty two houses on level three. Forty two houses of all casts on level three. This is one. This is two. We gotta get up. Wait, this is two. We gotta get up here. Oh, it might be doable because of the river there. Uh, okay, we'll go for it. That town down there is functioning. Oh, not level three up there. This level three. Oh, okay. That makes a little more sense. Okay. Well, I can't satisfy. I can. I can probably do the food, fish. I can do fish. Need to be near a river. 
I think we'll just sort of fish this spot right here. We'll move. These bads aren't going to happen. Let's fish over here. Don't hit shift. You don't need shift. They build automatically. They, they <laughs> keep doing that. And then we just want to send them. Maybe maybe that's enough. Um, into one of these guys. What is that? Trading posts. Buying and selling resources, huh? Just throw them all into there. Then they go down, way down over here. Okay, fish. And we have just barely enough fish. Nice. We're not up there yet, it's okay. It's a dangerous place to be. Ooh, actually that almost hit my fish that I just made. Lots of mines up here too. And we're short on artisans again. Artisans are, are a problem. I need a way. I need like a whole new artisan home. I'm gonna take three more types of prosperity. I don't even have the ability to do that. Yeah, these artisans are a problem. Everything needs artisans. And I just don't have the ability to make them and feed them all. Yeah, for instance. For instance. But you can reach everywhere by that little square there. And these are only going to hold a few people. I mean, it's something... Be tough. Forty-two houses. Okay, so there's there's fish. Let's deal. What, what what do you guys need? You only need like a gong would do it, huh? If I just had a gong nearby. Oh, that's level one. Level two needs a lot of stuff. So the most reasonable one's going to be down here, and that is just some sort of alignment, which would be incense, a yak guardian, or a summit temple. Incense is level three. Hmm. Incense, is that a decorative thing? Incense production, there it is. Can I do this? I can't do it now? Oh, no, level three. I guess I can do herbs and cedar wood now. Then we need an incense micro, which I can't do. Okay, um, I don't know that I'm going to be able to get there anytime soon, anyway. So I have to either build another academy and then do the incense thing. It might be. It might be okay. Um, I can fit a... I can fit a cat, one of these here. I got enough monks to, to supply it already. These kinds of things, this is nice to have around the houses, but also it's taking away, like, precious space that's near the food supply. It would fit there if I want to remove that road. Do I want to remove that road right there? Is it doing me any good? Is it is anything using that road? Nothing's yelling at me. Wrong with this? Oh, is it not quite right there? I guess this doesn't really have to go. Yeah, I do want it around by the houses. I don't know. I think 
I'm gonna have to. I think I'm gonna have to do that. Basically, re rearrange everything. These um. You can choose what you want to share in FaceTime once you've started. Okay, thanks, a thanks, 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 Siri. <laughs> um. I can put it here. Like I have all of this cheese maker nonsense. I can move that. That doesn't need to be here, and I can, and I that would give me another spot for one of these. Where this is cheese land over here. Yeah, so there's a couple of yak shacks. Monks like to be highest. Yeah, that. Yeah. Um, I could move all my monk land up here, and that would that would do it too. That gives them a the level two, and then level three is gonna be even more tricky though. Let's just solve this one first. Incense. We want incense. Oh, they want to be even higher than this one. They want to be up, up top. Okay, so let's move this stuff. So I'm going to set up... I think I need a separate... A whole separate setup. Because it's going to go to the, city, the other town. Provide 540 citizens with access to Mandala. Who's getting stormy? Stormy? I kind of want to see what happens. I kind of don't want to do it, so I see what happens. We all have it. But I don't have any room. What about Yaks? Do Yaks like Mandalas? That's not going to be 500. Uh, what do we need? I need like... That's not going to be enough. Um, let's do this. Scary. Okay, you're going away. There we go, done. I kind of want to see what happened if I didn't do it. Uh, what do you need? You, you level dropped. Because you don't have enough honey. Easy enough. That was the one that was going... That's the two that I had, so we need a third one over here. We'll do like four of them. That I'm going. To, I'll go ahead and get a honey for the other side too. Well, you know what? If it's not complaining, I'm not going to do it because that just means I need. I means I need more artisans. <clears throat> okay, that's did solve another need. We need another food here, which would be. Oh, they don't have fish or eggs here. That could be easily done. And a gong. I can make a gong, so I could get these guys to level three by just bringing some fish in. I only have just enough fish, though. So I have to put fish, like, up here. And that place gets hit by a volcano. Or whatever they're called. Avalanche. Okay, you want fish. Here's your dang... Oh, don't, don't hit shift. Different roads. I am building them more expensive roads. Oops. When did I, when did I switch that over? And whoops. <laughs> I probably should upgrade all those. That might help out some things. Just having bigger, better roads. Okay, so you are going to go into this guy. I need more artisans, of course. And this fish is going to go to the monks. Okay, there you go. There's your fish. So now you just need a gong. Tell me gongs are small, please. 
Oh, they're tiny. Well, not that tiny. Why doesn't it fit there? I mean, how much space do you need? Oh, it's a four. gong like in here um oh i also have to fill these these two like this empty one with anything oh yeah so i guess i'll have to get some eggs over there i if i need a rope right there You're level two. You're level two. How come you have so much more stuff? What do you have that he doesn't? Oh, you're in range of the academy. Yeah. I'm running out of money because I can't. I can't keep um, these guys going. I'm just gonna have to. I'm gonna have to like do a lot of. Adjusting. Because I have to build like, like a whole artisan town. And ship everything over to the artisan town. In order to keep them supplied. Um, I have enough people for another monastery. So in order to get this level three, I got I got to fill up. I got to put in one of these and in, or the um, incense, for instance, and then three of something else. Okay, decoration will fix that. What are you guys missing? Decoration and utensils. Yeah. Um, ale would, would do some things too. Okay. Now, I want to see if I can just get one thing to level three. What's going to be the easiest one to get there? Probably this. We just need one more thing. A oh, a decoration would do it. Hooray! It's working! Okay, cool. Alright. I just got to get a whole lot more. So, like, a decoration over here would do something. Wouldn't it? Because it can be anything. I don't seem to care about that. It has to be something that... No, you know, no. It has to be something that, that they want. Like a yak race. Like, everyone wants a yak race, of course. There's a yak breeder. A compact one. So this takes fodder and increases my yak population. I don't know how much fodder I am. I making fodder? Is that something that comes out of you? Hey. And then it goes to... I don't know that I'm actually making any fodder. I don't know how that works. Okay. 
Oh, it's snowy. So there's the hay. I'm assuming that's what I want to send out, and I can send that out to whatever, and that will re lead to my the fodder. Okay. 300 not collected donations. So this this would be moved. This could be moved to get a little bit more. They have to all just be artisans crammed in here. They're not gonna be very good spots though. A decoration could could bump up a couple of these guys though, or help. Nothing's in, nothing's really in a good spot for it. Nope. Oh, there's something. So now it just needs utensils. Um, which are getting made. Aren't they getting made? Where are those getting made at? Oh, they are getting made right here. That's also a lot of space I could free up. All this stuff. Not the cart post, but the... All of these. The mine, of course, has to stay there. And it has to go to the post. And the mine... Actually, I can move the mine. We got all this up here. All the mines. Both mines could go here. All copper production, utensil production could go there. That frees up a lot of space in there. Probably for monastery. Not that I need it. Um, there's the shrine. And there's the yak. The yak guardian. What's the... Um, what's the... Thing they want at the top. What's the top shrine? They want the summit temple. Put summit temple on top of the mountain. How do I do that? Oh, avalanche barrier. Goat farms. There's fodder production. So you make barley fields and you make those. Okay, I missed all those. There's ale brewing. Barley, charcoal pile, brewery. Pigment with rock crystals. We saw those over there. There's the yak and the butter beater. Let me try one thing here. It's going to be expensive, but we'll see if this does anything. It will do a lot, probably. Increasing the reach of some of these things. Problem is it's expensive. It's real expensive. Road up, keep 200, 300 bucks for the just, just having those roads in there. Be real careful about where I'm using that. And then same thing over here. I could probably get upgrades. I'm not sure it's worth that right now. But I'm gonna do it. That put me up to 16 houses, actually. I'm actually almost there. Well, not really. If I put them in here, I'm losing money, though. I also have this... A lot of people aren't paying. No one's in range of, of my, my guy. Put one up here. Pay up! Still broke. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna try doing this. It's expansive. Um, not working. Okay. 
Hey, I'm in the positive. need access to this so things things can things people can get over there worth a shot Man, now now I'm real broke yeah well, it's it's end of stream time, which is why I'm doing this. It's cool though; it adds in like like the squares there. Looks way cooler. It even adds in like levels there. Yeah, my money's going down now. Nah, I'm broke. Roads are expensive. Let's call it a day. I could probably get away with this reach for... Oh, it reaches all the way over there now. Hey, you know what? There we go. More people. Look at that one, though. There's going to be a lot more space. I need to be adding in these guys, though. I if I can put one back here and still get it. No. Oh, um... Eh, no, no, no. We got no more negative. Well, we're still negative money. No. Oh. Thanks, Frag Jolt. Still losing money. Um, but, anyway, I'm going to call it a day. Thanks for hanging out tonight. This is Lasara Summit Kingdom. It is, uh, it is out now. That works. Now, now in, uh, in Early Access... That was the standard mode. There's the challenge mode. We come in here. I messed with this one just a little bit. Only Yak matters. So, for instance, this is like the um, quick challenge. It's like we're kind of doing there. We're trying to meet those goals. It's just basically that's the game. This one, get 300 Yaks. Can I just make Yaks? Yaks with roads. Good. Now we got no money. <laughs> but there you go. There you go. There you go. So get the goal. That kind of thing. Is this mountain any different? Oh, yeah. A tiny, tiny mountain. On this one. Anyway. Whoop. There is Lasara Summit Kingdom. We've got. Oh, a roadmap. 1.0 scenario and challenges trading between player towns. Photo mode. Okay. Thank you for watching. I will see you tomorrow and we will play something else.